Good morning friends my name is Ishwari Shashikant Gite and today i am going to tell you a story my story name is the ugly tree once upon a time there was a big forest it had many trees in the forest like apple papaya and banana one was a very ugly tree it had a crooked trunk the other trees used to tease him One day the tree said, "Oh god, why did you make me so ugly? Why I am not beautiful like the other trees?" One day a woodcutter came to the forest and he cut all the trees and he said, "No, no, I don't want this crock trunk tree. I will cut the other trees and sell them into the market." He cut the other trees and went to sell them into the market. The where the ugly tree said, Oh god thank you for my ugliness today it saved my life Hi friends I am Manus today I am going to tell a small story my story name is controlling anger once there was a little boy he always used to be very angry once day his father told him whenever you get angry you must turn on one nail into the fan the boy always used to be very angry On the first day, he had thirty nails in the fence. Over the next few days, the boy learned to control his anger. So now, the number of the nails boy hammer gradually came down. Finally, one day came when he realized not getting angry anymore. He ran to his father and shared about this. His father was very happy. Father, father said, father said, whenever you are able to control your anger, you are supposed to remove one nail from the fence. Has the day passed? The boy removed all the nails into the fence. He went to his father and shared about this. Father said, "Well done, my son. But look at the fence. Even though you have removed all the nail from the fence, the holes are still there. But the fence is not not same." Moral of the story is, anger is a bad thing. You should not get angry. Good morning teachers my name is Unnati Sachin Singh I belong to fourth standard my school name is Norma School English Medium I now today we will see one story the thirsty crow it was summer the day was very hot a crow was very thirsty he looked for water here and there but he he could not find any here At the last, he saw a pot of a with a little water inside. The food of a pan. He collected two stones from nearby the drop them into into the pot one by one. The crow drink water and feel very happily. Moral of the story is we should we should use our common sense. Thank you.